breaking news this morning. We've been following it all morning long. Five people shot overnight on Morgan State University's campus in Baltimore, and we know four of the victims are students. The university's president said all classes today will be canceled. This all happened around 9.30 last night, raising alarms for parents all over our region. News for Malik Green has more. And uh, first off, the good news is for uh, those people watching, all five uh, shot are expected to survive. Let me tell you, a lot has happened uh, in the 30 minutes since we last talked to you. I'll step out of the way. Uh, the campus police uh, and Baltimore police uh, removed the tape that surrounded the building here at Thurgood Marshall Hall. That is a dormitory, a freshman dormitory. I spoke with the Morgan State campus police officer who told me uh, that they're not done, of course, with this investigation, but they have been collecting evidence. We've seen officers, investigators walking around with evidence bags. We have seen more students walking around on the campus as well, uh, some of them from the Thurgood Marshall dormitory, which is a freshman uh, dormitor dormitory. I'm standing right here on the sidewalk between that dorm and the Fine Arts Center. We did get a chance to speak with a parent drove all the way here from New York City to check on his daughter, who is a resident at that dormitory. Let's hear what he had to say. I want to I want to know what are you going to do to make me feel comfortable leaving my daughter here? My daughter's 18. She's a fresh. She's never been away from home. So I, how are you going to make me feel comfortable leaving my daughter, not having her transfer to another school? Obviously, very, very unsettling news to any parent who sends a kid off to camp college, especially uh, a child who is in his or her freshman year. Uh, we did talk to another student from that freshman dormitory a little while ago who says he's leaving, going back home to Boston because there's just too much happening right now on campus. So as we know, uh, police held a press conference uh, after all of this happened last night around 9.30 in the midst of homecoming festivities where they were having coronation for Mr. and Miss Morgan State University. Uh, there has been no arrests in the case. That's all we understand. We know that a Baltimore uh, city councilman uh, tweeted out that there could have been as many as three shooters involved. Police have not confirmed that. This is still an active investigation and we'll stay on top of the latest developments uh, here from campus. Back to you guys. Um, we'll be covering this story all morning long, really all day long. So make sure you stay with News 4 for updates in the NBC Washington app and on our website at NBCWashington.com.